I uh, have already installed the Linux operating system onto a server and also installed the secure shell on that server and now I'm able to remotely access the server uh, via the IP address. Now hopefully you found the IP address before you closed out of your server and went to a remote location. Uh, if you have not gotten your IP address uh, you will need to go back to the server and find out what that IP address is and your IP address will vary based on the network and how your network administrator allows you to set up your machine. So what I have here in front of you is I have the terminal program which runs in Mac OS X. Uh, if you do not have the terminal program or Mac OS X you can download a program called Putty which is a Windows application which is free. You can use that to access your server remotely. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to use the secure shell which we installed on the server and I'm going to SSH into the server at this point. So the command structure goes like this SSH space hyphen L I'm going to use the username I used to create I created at the beginning of the uh, during the installation in this case for me it was admin and then I'm going to type the IP address of the server which is 172.17.254.2 it's prompting me for the password as you see right here and your password will not show up as you enter it shows here some information the last time uh, I logged in and as you can see here I have set my username as well as the machine that I am working on.